Hello, and welcome to the second episode of the Paint Pigment Making Series. Today, I am attempting to turn activated charcoal into oil paint. I got the charcoal that I'm using on Amazon, and it's very fine and also very messy, which is actually a great characteristic of pigments. I start by placing my charcoal on a glass slab and add a few drops of walnut alcohol to it. Walnut alkyd is my favorite medium because it dries quite quickly and is very stable. However, linseed oil is the most commonly used. I then start mulling the paint with my DIY oil muller towards a consistency that's smooth and buttery. It also looks quite coarse and not as smooth as I'd like, but we'll see how it acts on canvas. Here I'm testing the charcoal paint out on a piece of primed canvas. I paint the color as it is, another patch for the color mixed with white, and I usually mix with black, but it's already black so that would be pretty redundant. I instead made a gradient going from the lightest washes of the charcoal to its darkest. I personally think that it's a very pleasant black. I also like to carry out tests on these pigments, usually evaluating them against three criteria. Color fastness, light fastness, and the experience of using and handling them. However, this time, I already know that charcoal is very light and color fast, so it will already have to have full points for those. For the overall experience, I would have to get back to you after five weeks and see how it dried. So it's been 5 weeks since I've made this charcoal paint test. My biggest fear with charcoal was that it wouldn't bond properly, and unfortunately I was right. The charcoal is coming right off, which makes me very hesitant to want to use it again. I feel like I mulled it well enough, which makes me think that maybe charcoal doesn't work well with walnut alkit. Let me know what you think I could do to try to fix this. As for the rating, I have to give charcoal a 1 star. It's beautiful, but it has too major of a flaw. Anyways, thanks for watching, I hope you found this video interesting, and I'll be making more of them every Thursday. So if you have any ideas for what pigment I should make paint out of next, leave a comment down below.